Frieza. I never thought I'd be joining forces with you. Joining forces? What a preposterous notion. Do you think that you, a simple Namekian, are worthy of fighting alongside the great Frieza? What? If I recall, and I am never wrong, you're the one who shielded Goku's son from my powerful attack. Well then, I don't recommend sacrificing yourself again to protect him this time. Sorry to disappoint you. I don't plan on being anybody's Namekian shield. Oh, so you're finally ready to abandon the brat. A wise choice, ridding yourself of useless trash. The opposite, actually. He doesn't need me to protect him. He's more than capable on his own. I trained him to be that way. So what is it you're trying to say? That your special training is what toughened him up? He and I have been training together for a long time. Even you should know that. And it's not just Gohan. I've gotten stronger too, you know. I don't need to hear about your relationship with the brat or how strong you think you are. Rather than bragging, it'd be more convincing if you were willing to prove it in battle. With pleasure.
It's Vegeta's. Are you sure, Goku? Yep, it's his. Well, in that case, then we better get moving. Is everyone ready to go? Wait just a second. Since when have you decided everything? Why should I risk my own life to help an ungrateful traitor such as him? This really isn't the time. We need as much help as we can get. Yeah, perhaps you're right. I hate to admit it, but Vegeta is likely to be of some kind of use. It's not ideal, but so be it. I suppose we do need his strength. Fine, fine. I'll make an exception just this once. There he is! Hey, Vegeta! Are you alive? He's alive, but unconscious. How amusing. Even unconscious, he can still make my skin crawl with rage. Maybe I should just kill him while I have the chance. What the? Hey, that's not what you said earlier. Wait. This is no time to be quarreling. Seems I'll let him live for now. Besides, we have a visitor. Better deal with that first. We all teamed up to help defeat Android 21. <laughs> hey, Vegeta, are you listening? Of course I'm listening, Kakarot. But I'll be taking no part in this. Come on, you can't be serious. Don't you want to be a part of the fight with Android 21? That's not the issue here. You do seem a little uneasy. It wouldn't have something to do with me being found, would it? I feel the same as you, Vegeta. Do you think I'd choose a Saiyan as an ally? I should have guessed it'd come to this. What else did you expect? Those two obviously hate each other's guts. Calm down, you guys. Maybe you should watch what you say, Frieza. That soul inside you might stop you in your tracks again. If you want to continue being selfish instead of helpful, you can go. Look, Vegeta. I know how you feel. But this isn't the time to dig up old grudges. That's right. 21 is like nothing we've ever faced before. We can't access our full power right now. So this is the only option we got. 
You're no fool, Vegeta. Surely you know where your priorities should lie. D damn it! Fine. I'll cooperate for now. There's no point dragging this out any longer. As long as Vegeta doesn't cause any trouble, I'm sure he'll make an excellent soldier. Don't tell me what to do! It seems you got the wrong idea, Frieza. I'd never willingly join forces with you! It would seem that the boy is not completely alone. It's not another clone, is it? I've had rather enough of them, I must say. Gohan is mine! Back off! I will not allow you to take this from me. I think I understand now, but are you sure this is okay? I mean, Frieza and Cell, can they be trusted? Oh, seems like your son's the only one with a shred of common sense. This coalition was your father's idea. Not exactly ideal for me either, but it's a little late to start doubting now. The truth is, Cell can't access his full power either, so we're all in the same boat. And Frieza, the soul inside, is stopping him from doing anything bad, so don't worry. I guess you're talking about linking, right? You're still having trouble coming to terms with it. Think of it like this. It's like we're keeping an eye on Cell and Frieza while we fight the other bad guys. Okay, I suppose that makes sense. When you put it like that, I guess you can count me in. I think I heard correctly when you said, uh, whatever. 
At least you won't get under my feet like some foolish, over-trusting slacker. Well, it seems quite obvious you have little or no fighting experience. Cacket the victim will probably teach you to scratch those guilty souls. I'm not going to go easy on you. If it's strength you want, you damn better well earn it. Being linked to me is an advantage in itself, but it's also a privilege. If you're going to use my body, don't bumble around the battlefield like some buffoon! Let's take out these guys and rescue the boys! Very well. But let's hurry. I'd rather not waste any more time than we have to. What wonderful, clever boys. They can already tell that I am the strongest fighter here. There's a reason for him to be here. There's something I gotta tell you first. You see, we're being chased by an incredibly powerful enemy called Android 21. So you guys need to get to Dende right away where you'll be safe, okay? Android 21! 
No way! I'm not gonna run away! We wanna stay and fight, huh, Goten? It's no fair! The adults get to have all the fun! Right, I get it. I know exactly how you boys feel, but I can't let you get involved this time. Why was it okay for us to fight Boo, but this time we can't? Well, when you put it like that, I guess. It would be ridiculous of me to say no. Trunks! I think we need to show them that we can really fight! All right, Goten, are you ready? You! Yeah! Just let them fight. Weaklings always die anyway, regardless of whether they fight or not. Hey, I won't hold you guys back, I promise. Honestly, I'm really strong. Just do as you please. But if you so much as show an inkling of getting in my way, I'll obliterate you. <laughs> 